So it is no secret that I've been playing like complete poo recently. So we gotta step it up here, TJ. With first season, we came in hot, and then we cooled right off. Um, also, I think this thing means I get it at the end of the year, right? So I'm done with this social media hotshot shenanigans, so I should be getting it at the end of the year, I believe. So we'll have another ability at the end of this year, which is nice. Uh, as of right now, nope, not gonna be getting it. And yeah, there's five things I can afford. I don't really know if it's gonna help us too much right now. I'll probably just wait, but regardless, let's see if we can pick up our game here. We got the Washington Capitals. They are 8, 11, and 1. We are 12, 7, and 2. Let's do this thing. Come on, TJ. At least get a half decent sim in there. Nice. That's an all right start. And oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Let's jump in. Let's go. So I guess maybe you guys probably, well, you definitely won't see a difference because I still have like four or five of these still not uploaded. But regardless, yeah, I did take a break. I haven't recorded one of these in several days. So I'm back now, hopefully feeling a little fresh. We can go in here and not get lit up like a Christmas tree. That would be sick if we could pull that off. So uh, Timothy Jimothy or TJ, we need a big, wow, we have a three minute power play as well. So we are starting off this third period with some free team play. That is just an absolute gift. Orlov goes to Haglin. They're not even dumping it down. Or are they? No, they're skating it. They know that they are down bad. And they got to try and do something here. I was kind of wondering why the Capitals started the players they did. I'm like, why is Haglin out there and Lars Eller? But anyway, yeah, it makes sense now. Oh, Bouchard, he almost kept it. He was so close. TJ Oshie. He has it. That will be stopped. You're wide open, Barry. So I'm going to dish that out to you. Still got two minutes on the power play here. In the middle to Dano. He's in. Oh, he manages to get past a backhander on net. But Riddick will kick that away. All right. We still got a buck 47 left on this power play. Things are looking good. I don't know what that was a top 10 for. I didn't get to read it. But anyway, let's do this thing. We need a big draw win here. Come on, Philippe. Nope, he lost it. Marie goes to Timothy Jimothy, who is not going to send it down the ice, despite being on the PK. Amazing. And then he ends up losing it. Yamamoto gets it up to Yessi. Oh, you had the guy in the middle there. Good pass, though, to Yamamoto. We're setting up shop. Dano gets pinned. Oshii comes in to help his teammate. And, yeah, that worked out. Now he has it in the middle to Connor McMichael, who stops up, goes to take a shot, and that will not be what he imagined. I'm thinking, anyway. Pretty sure it went off our defender, Radulov. Nice try. He got poked. Let's go, TJ. Timothy Jimothy. I actually just called him TJ unironically. But anyway. Oh! Nope. Don't do it. Don't panic. Just kind of chill. Nice. Good job, defense. That's what you love to see. Oh, she gets it again, though. Man, this has been... Nothing more than a pathetic power play. <laughs> like, we have done pretty much nothing. Come on, Yessi, let's try to get something going here. Well, the power play is done, actually. And then we... That's probably our best chance yet. And that is after the power play is done. All right. Tim Winston. He's in. And he stops up. Goes to Ovechkin. That's going to be a scary shot if I see one of those. Jensen in the middle to Wilson, who takes a low glove shot. Pass that out to Radulov. That was a risky play, too, because Ovi was right there. Probably shouldn't have done that. But what's done is done. Ovi with it again. I thought I was going to get some free team play, man. I was gassed. Oh, that should have been a bigger hit than it was. I'm a little disappointed. Down low. And Wilson going to get knocked off of it. Little battle there. But the Oilers come out on top. All right. So, so far, this game's going all right. I like the way this one is shaping up so far. Good job, Hyman. You killed it there. That was a great decision. Capitals storming back the other way. In the middle to Kuznetsov. Who gets it? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, oh, no. Thank you. Ah, the defense. Yeah, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I don't care. Sometimes the recording breaks work. Sometimes they don't. This time, it's looking pretty good so far. You know, made a few stops. Nothing insane by any standard, but, you know, just keeping it basic. Keeping the puck out of the net. And it's, uh, you know, better than I was doing before, that's for sure. But I still have tons of time to absolutely destroy everything I just said. So, um, let's see. If I'll do that, or if I'll hopefully just keep playing well. Ryan is going to get knocked off the puck. Nutivara gets it up to Carl Haglin. He's in, in the middle to Hathaway, who goes to take a clap bomb. Oh my, 
Why did he slide so far to the right when I butterflied there? I meant to just drop to the butterfly and I like barely touched the right stick and he was like, whoa, what? Why does it do that? That is weird. Okay, note to self. Don't press a direction when going into butterfly. <laughs> just go into butterfly and then do your movements because that is absurd. Just slides halfway across the crease. If I just like a little tap, just a little tap on the analog and he goes sailing. In the middle. Oh, Lars Eller! Oh, the mini weed stack! I can't believe that. I totally missed the flying poke check. But I still may- I got it. That's got to be a thumbnail. It has to be. Uh, are you kidding me? Look at this. He totally beat me too. And then- <laughs> No way I got him with that. That is iconic. Wow. Alright, let me um, try to get a good one here. That's uh, That's pretty solid. You know? Move over a little bit, perhaps. Actually, it kind of looks better from this angle, no? Oh yeah, that's good stuff. That is that is some quality stuff right there. Team play. All right, let me change the camera and pass that over to you, Fogel. Nice breakout play. Look at that. I was the defender pretty much there. <laughs> Just subbed in for the defenseman's job. Hathaway passes it in the middle. And here comes Lars again. That man got absolutely robbed earlier. Nudavara, that will be saved. Very risky pass. I gotta cut that out immediately. But it hasn't backfired yet. It's going to. It will, eventually. But it hasn't yet. TJ. Timothy Jimothy. The other Timothy Jimothy. Well, through a crowd. Still making the blocker stop. Seven and a half remaining. Alright, this would be a huge redemption, man. If I can keep playing like this. We need this. We need the momentum shift because it was going downhill fast. Backstrom. He's in. Over the line. Goes for a deke and a great hit there to knock him off of it. Yes, he goes across to McDusty. Come on. Do it. Oh, what a play. That was a sick behind the back pass. But a great stop from David Riddick. Oshi. Whoa! <laughs> he just stood up McDavid big time. Wow. McDusty just ran into a wall. That was crazy. Pass that to you. Ooh, Backstrom came in hot. I didn't even see him there. Why do I keep, like, changing or not changing the camera? Sometimes I remember and sometimes I don't. Nice passing. Oh, great shot. That was a tricky save, I would imagine. I can't really remember what we're doing. Are we doing play one, sim two? What a save again. This has been a goaltender duel in this third period. I think we were doing... Was it play one, sim one, maybe even? Was I not doing two? I can't remember. Eh. I'll play one sim one and just keep at that pace for now. See what happens. But I know that we are getting quite a lot of starts. We're basically the starting goalie now. At a mere, what are we, 77 overall? So that's good. <laughs> Ovechkin is chasing Hyman. Don't you dare lose that. You carried it behind the net. You cannot lose that now. This will be on you. All right. I mean, he didn't really win it, but he also didn't lose it, per se. Darney came in to help him out. Three minutes to go in this third period. And things have gone quite well up until now. Kuzi. Nice defense. Not letting him enter the zone. No clean entry. Oh, no, but they still got it. Ovechkin. What are you guys doing? Don't let this guy have it there. Holy crap. That was a deadly zone to let that man into. And just, he waltzed straight in. No problem. Didn't even have a hall pass. Final minute. And they are pulling their goalie at the worst possible time. Never mind. They put him back. TJ, let's go get that. No! Get back in your net. Get back in your net. Whoa! Bouchard, what are you doing? I wasn't even in the net. It was completely empty. And he passed it directly across the crease. That has to be the riskiest play I have ever seen in my entire life. At the very least, it's up there, you know? So... Let's maybe try to refrain from doing that in the future. All right, goalie's out, and they go offside. Great job, Capitals. You're doing well. <laughs> no goals at this point. Will your boy get the shutout? Let's find out. It is 2-0, 30 seconds left, and the Caps win the draw, but it didn't really work out in their favor, honestly. Oshi goes in the middle. Drysidle will pick it off. And it looks like the Capitals are going to get a clean zone entry here from Murray, but Bouchard will step up and take it off of him. Goligoski goes across to Yamamoto in the middle to Dreisaitl, an easy empty net goal to make it 3-zip 
15 seconds left. We have won this game, which is great. We needed that. We needed a bounce back game, and we managed to do it. Now let's see how these last 15 seconds go. They are kind of critical, for me anyway. Nine seconds remaining. Oh yeah, just skate it back. Just skate it. I wish I could call for the puck, like in a player be a pro. Ovi has it, and that will do it, lads. A shutout for TJ. Great game for the Oilers all around. And I think I'll be one of the stars, probably. I might even be first star. A 26 save shutout? It's possible. I wouldn't rule it out entirely. Let's see here. Second star, Darny with one and one. a boy. Had a great game. First star, TJ, baby. 26 save shutout. All right, let's see. Is James going to have something nice to say? If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say it at all, James. And hey. What can you say? And hey. Love. I want to see this. I'm seeing a lot of it on social media already. But he just deserves Social more, media. Right? Ugh. Did you get your first NHL shutout? There is a true sign as a young puck stopper that you officially belong in the league. Right? Belong. I mean, he just looks so cool and calm out there. And some of that brand like ability at up. the same time. Like, there were some ones that went, wow, like, there's a next level stop out there. Did that a few times, and congratulations nah. to that young man who is going to always remember this night, as I'm sure a lot of people will. Yo, I'm hungry. Very bright future ahead. <laughs> uh, and yo, hey, you also got to give some. I don't know if the mic's going to pick that up, but holy. That was a grumble and a half. I got to eat after this Great video. To be on the couch and All right, James, no thanks. Uh, Sim to next game. We are in. Against the San Jose Sharks. So they are 31st in the league. Let's see how this one goes. If it's close, I'll just jump in and then we'll do the whole sim. Okay, great. Six shots, two goals. Oh, that's a bit better. 3-2. That's a close enough game. We can hop in. And then I'll just sim two after this one. Here come the Sharkies early on. LeBanc goes for a shot. That won't make it through, though. Nurse would be in the way of that one. Oh, yeah, Connor. Start off the third period hot. Not really. Adden Hill. Gonna put that one in the mitten. One minute in, and so far, it's been pretty fast-paced. Let's see if we'll keep that pace up or not. Big draw here. We are down by one at the moment. But, I mean, I could see the boys tying it up. Easy peasy. Oh, if he went for that backdoor pass to Yessie. Could have had it, but he instead got defended. LeBanc goes in the middle. Wow, I got that with the very tip of my glove. That was incredibly close. Smother it. Uh, okay, please get there. Please get there. My bad. I misread that. Oh, no. This is going to be all my fault. This is going to be all my fault if it goes in. Couture. Back to Ferraro. Who tries to walk in. Oh, no. Great job. Just getting the twigs in the way. That was a risky pass, but it worked out. I'm no stranger to those, so you know what? I really shouldn't be judging the team on risky passes because I have my fair share of those as well. McDusty. Oh, ho, ho, just gets his stick in the way. That was incredible. Almost a sick one T, but no! Oh, cross crease pass. What a weasel. No way you slid that far for that save. I didn't do that, by the way. I did not do that. <laughs> he slid eight miles out. For literally no reason. I did make the save, thankfully. Because otherwise I would have been fuming. But I'm still a little upset as to why that happened. Like, there was no reason to fly eight feet out of the crease there. There's literally no reason. Okay, you know what? You're not going to step up for your teammate? I'll do it then. I'll fight their goalie. Adden Hill, you're going down, kid. Actually, we got a power play out of that, so never mind. I'll let it let it fly for now. Deno almost had the rebound there. That would have been huge. All right, yes, he gets it back to Bouchard, who tries to rip a shot. Barry does get one through, and Hill will make the stop. Down below the net. Oh, man. Nice try. Dano gets knocked off of it. And now Benino will send it down the ice. I will change up the camera, but I don't even think it's going to come to me. Well, there goes my team play. Sorry, folks. And uh, sorry, boys. Just kind of killed our power play there. That's unfortunate. Well then. Now it's time to fight. Now I'm scrapping because I am pissed. Get over here, Hill. Team play is already done at this point. So screw it. Here we go. 
You are done for. And by that, I mean I'm probably done for. Because I think we've already established that uh, Tino Manny was the scrapper. And TJ is the puck stopper. So, this is our second fight, I believe. And the first one we got rinsed. I can't remember who it was by. But it looks like, right now, TJ's actually doing alright. Avoid that. And, no way. Okay. Good night. There we go. Big dub. And let's just skate right through him. Just to show him who's boss. Don't even pick up your helmet. Screw it. We don't need that. So I've now taken two penalties in this third period as a goaltender. I don't think the uh, coach is going to be super excited about that. But sucks to suck because I'm here regardless. I'm still shocked that you can get sent down to the AHL. I didn't know that was possible. Oh, nice shot. Big save though. Oh no. Oh no. There's a battle along the boards and I think they're going to come out with it. They do. Hurdle takes a low shot and that will be... Stopped by the right mini weed of TJ. Battle at the blue line, and it is an offside, thankfully. 12 21 remaining here. We are still scoreless in the third period, anyway. And we need a goal here to tie this bad boy up. We could do it. Absolutely, we can. You kidding me? Have you seen our roster? We're sick. And we can't even win a draw. I take it back. No, I don't. I don't take it back. Dry Saddle's gonna score? What are you doing? Just shoot the puck. There was so many unnecessary movements there. Puck is at the point, and Bouchard gets in the way of that pass. So the Oilers are headed back on the attack. Oh, he takes a great shot, too. That definitely threw off the goaltender, but he still managed to get a piece of it. Dreisaitl gets it in the slot, and Merkley will be there for the rebound. Radulov picking off a pass now. Finds his way over to Hyman, who gets pinned against the boards there. Does get the puck deep, though, once again, living up to his intermission interview. San Jose is in. And they are trying to get themselves... Wow, that was a bullet. An insurance marker. They want that comfort. Wow, another bullet. Okay, okay, what is going on here? Managed to save that one. Jeez. That was three shots that were just complete missiles. Would strongly prefer if they just didn't do that ever again. Let's go, what a goal. Mick David gets a pass down low. He streaks towards the net and beats the goalie short side. Yo, those Oilers jerseys, I forgot about those. But anyway, that is huge. Tie game in the third period. Let's see the replay here. Connor gets the pass. He skates to the net, does a little fake that he's gonna go across the crease and then just puts on his forehand, buries it. Huge goal. And we have ourselves a 3-3 hockey game now. <laughs> Based on what I just saw there in the crowd, it looks like the fans can just walk right down to the bench. There's nothing stopping them. <laughs> That's what it looked like anyway. I could have totally been misseeing. I feel like that hit the post. Which, imagine if that went in. That would have been hilarious. Alright, Nieto. He's in. Over the line. Goes across. And that'll be picked up by the point man. Donato in the middle. Oh man, initial save is made and luckily... Nieto wasn't able to pick up the rebound. Brent Burns has it in the neutral zone, but he will lose it. And he is fuming. Goes to take off McDavid's head there. Holy. That was scary. No, he just missed the net. That's okay. Good job, Oilers. I like the way we're playing right now. This is huge. 3-3. Three, three. Uh, I definitely don't have enough shots for this to be a 900 save percentage performance. Even if they don't score again. But, you know, at least I'll redeem it a little bit and they still have tons of time to score a goal as well which will just ruin it even worse <laughs> so hopefully that doesn't happen need to get some team play redemption here you're kind no way no way he did that he just curled away he was like nah i don't really want it thanks though okay yeah there we go that's just gonna happen isn't it amazing 321 left gets scored on oh you hate to see it Please, I need to make a save. Oh, I actually made a save. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Pass out. My team play rating is probably going to be so bad. 2.30 to go. I am likely going to get pulled soon. Let's try to get some more team play there. Nice. Hyman skating up with it. Two-minute warning is inbound. Nice try on the pass. All right, Couture has it. I can't believe I paid that pass along the boards. Just gave them it. They managed to stay in the zone. That was an awful shot. Burns to Couture, who tries to walk out but gets rocked. Our player would trip over them. I can't even speak. I'm so hungry that my brain is just starting to fail on me. 
But I mean, I can't speak in videos anyway, even when I'm not hungry, so... Never mind, I take it back. That's just my excuse this time around. Yeah, team play is a D plus. Honestly, I'm surprised I didn't get an F. At least the saves and positioning is there. But overall, no. Just absolutely ruined by team play. Alright, Dreisaitl has it. Nurse. Nice. Go. Not really nice, but anyway. Here we go, Oilers. That managed to get through to Nuge. You try to take a shot. It won't go. And now Timo makes a pass to LeBanc. And our defense is going to back up. Let them have the zone and a free shot at the empty net. That is the way to do it. You're doing great. No way. Can't even get the puck past the neutral zone right now. And we have an extra man. What's going on here, Oilers? Get our act together. All right. Nice. Clean entry. Nuge in the middle. McDavid and the rebound. Are you kidding me? Pull Yarvi. Manages to bury the rebound. 8.2 remaining. This game is likely headed to overtime. Unbelievable. Yeah, right now they only have 21 shots. That's not good. You know, it would have been maybe a little tiny bit better if they still only had three goals, but they don't. They have four. Anyway, overtime, three-on-three three action. I'm probably going to get scored on again. Just going to be an absolutely horrendous save percentage. But let's see how this thing goes. Burns, he has the puck, and he gets it to Couture. I'm watching for the pass. I kind of knew that was going to happen. And another stop. Okay, that's a good start so far. McDavid, nice. Take the body there. Oh, he absolutely levels Burns. He just destroyed Burns. But whoever had the puck there completely choked and just gave it right to them. McDavid on the back check here. Now Timo takes a shot. That will be stopped by the oven mitt. San Jose still on the attack. Timo goes back to the point. Brent Burns wires a clapper from the point. Doesn't make it through. This has been a... High intensity start to the overtime, Timo. To Kachur, another save. Holy crap. To Burns, another stop. Nah, I'm, no, no shot. Oh, they won the draw too. Merkley with a point shot off the right. Mini Wheat once more kick to the side. Will we finally get some offense in here? Dry sidle. Oh, nice sneak. He has it in the middle. A great shot, but that will be saved. All right, Merkley with it now. He's in over the line. In the middle to Couture. He takes a shot. That is off the blocker. Barry. I feel like almost put that in our own net. Here we go, boys. Come on. You can do this. Yes. Nice pass. Dry sidle. I thought that wasn't going to go. I He had the entire net with that backhand. That was insane. I kind of want to see how this went in. Do I get a replay? I probably don't get a replay. So I'm going to have to go do it myself. I have to do everything myself around here. Anyway. Yeah. Let's check that out. I'm curious how that... Ended up finding its way in because I'm more so shocked that it didn't just go directly in. Here we go. Gets the nice pass. Huge. He's in one on O on the goalie. Hill fakes the... Like, look at how How's he going to stop that? He has the entire net. All right. But anyway, he shoots it. And... Oh, he did save it with the pad. He actually had it. And then it just kind of trickled. That is unfortunate. Hill made a phenomenal save there. And it still just happened to go in. Anyway, that was a pretty good game. Great overtime. I got an A- minus for saves. And I brought my team play up to a C-, minus, so we're basically right there for the target overall. Good stuff. Nice. What is... What's these sound effects? What the heck's going on? You're taking too many risks leaving your net? It's literally, look. Careless positioning. Taking too many risks leaving the net. Hints. Hold X to free skate. Thanks. For giving me advice on how to do exactly what you apparently don't want me to do. What are you, what are you saying, James? What's going on? Oh, hey, I want to bring it back to the kid here for just a second as he picks up his 20th career win here in the NHL. Light work. So good. Light so work. Soon. That's got to be, that's got to be a nice feeling. And you can see the training staff after this one. They were quick to grab the puck. And uh, you know what? That's sitting proudly, no doubt, in his locker, at least for oh, now. Sorry, uh, James. A nice little souvenir keepsake for him. Okay, well, uh, we are in against Calgary here. One of the things I'm no, most no, I've had enough, James, for today. You've had your spotlight. Can it? Well, we got the Battle of Alberta once again here. Calgary. Nice. Love that. Okay. A little bit of redemption there. And a 3-2 victory for Calgary. But they did end up having 31 shots. All right. I can't speak again. I got to get out of here. I got to go make some food. All right. Continue. You know, I will 
say this. And Despite you know, loss, I thought their young goaltender was great. He thank was you. one of the best players out there. Uh, he was definitely you know the best what? player for their team. And you know, silly they little still salary come perks. Away with the victory. But you know, you don't know what you're going to get from a young player in a hostile game and a rivalry game. You know what? He brought it. He was ready for this one. You can tell he was excited talking to him before the game, and he brought it. I was really Angles. impressed, and that's certainly encouraging Screw it. down the road. Now, when you look at some of the other numbers, why this team... Okay. Well, that is one sim game. I think I should sim, like, two games per game I play. So I think I'm going to do four here. Uh, let's maybe stick low. Might be a good idea. Playing puck, frequency, passing, poke check. Oh, you know what? I kind of do want poke check, but I feel like there's more important stuff right now. There's bigger fish to fry. What about aggressiveness? Dialogue? Absolutely not. Okay, so maybe I should. Maybe I should do stick low. Yeah, I suppose. Purchase that. Okay, LA Kings. Actually, we're not in for this one, so let's sim it. And that is an L. Amazing. Who's our backup again? Was it Pavel? I can't remember. Anyways, we are in for the Kraken. So let's sim this one. First period. Nice. Okay, I'll take it. Oh, I won't take that. Incredible. Just incredible. The Blue Jackets, once again, I'm gonna sim four games instead of two. So nice. Amazing. All right, that's, Im that's an improvement. I'll take that. 39 shots and only three goals. That is certainly a performance I will not frown upon. There you go, your three stars of the game. We did take an L, though. I feel like we're taking a lot of Ls here. 14, 10, and 3. What's going on, folks? What is going on? The Buffalo Sabres sim game. Here we go. This will be the last sim game of the video. Uh, decent first period. All right. And third period. Nice. A big victory. And a 19 save performance. From TJ, three stars. There you go. 950 save percentage. Not a big deal. Continue. All right. So, oh, I forgot to look at the Lions. I always show you guys the Lions at the beginning of the video. Well, maybe I'll show you now. No, I'll show you the stats. The Lions probably haven't changed. But I will show you next video, if I remember. Colorado Avalanche. We're probably going to be in this one. Yep. 13, 13, and 1. Let's have a look at the stats. Stats central. Team standings first. Our save percentage is... Slowly creeping towards that 900, which is nice. We are first in the Pacific right now. That is shocking. And, like, kind of convincingly as well. We are four points up on the Ducks, and we have one less game. But the LA Kings have two games on us. And uh, they have 27. So, I don't know. We're actually doing pretty good right now. In the entire league, we're ninth. Nice. All right, good stuff. For the individual player stats, Mick Dubstep has 35 in 28. And then we have a point of game from Nuge. Look at this guy go. Proud of you. Dreisaitl, 25 in 28. Pogliarvi, 25 as well. Yamamoto, 19. Radulov, 18. Deno, 18. And here's the rest of the players there. All right. Let's see an Art Ross from McDavid this year. Come on, you can do it. Let's go to the goaltender. So we have... Where is the other goalie? Oh, I went to rookie goalies. Whoopsies. Goalies. It is Pavel. So yeah, he is 4-5-0 and with an 8-94 and a 301. And then we are 11-7-3 and with a shutout and an 896. So we're we're right there. We're so close to that 900. We can do it. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Um, I'm very glad we had a bounce back there. That was huge. Two wins in the games we jumped into. And I think we won two of the games we simmed as well and lost two, but... Yeah, overall, I'd say that was a very solid bounce back and a well-needed one at that. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you, and I will see you soon.